Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poigie here, getting ready to take out the Chinese 1.3 i16 Chung 28 in Air Arcade. Um, not my favorite plane, not by a long shot. So, elevator's not very strong on it. It's not very fast. It doesn't climb that well. Um, you only get two guns in the early variants. The later ones have four, which obviously you can do a lot more damage with. Um, but I think we're really relegated to be like a support aircraft. We really have to stay on our side of the... Uh, the battlefield and uh, just support and try and shoot some guys down. If you get into one-on-ones with this or, you know, any fair fight, you're uh, likely to lose. So let's take it out and see what we can do. All right, so we're on an air dom map. Really doesn't matter which one. Uh, stealth ammo, 800 meter targeting distance, minimum fuel load. Let's go ahead and climb a little bit to the right here at 30 degrees with our weapon. Um, this one's going to be tough. So typically I'd want to be in an air dom map, be, try to be the highest player and uh, just kind of work my way down. We're not going to be able to get there with this plane, uh, especially we don't have engine injection yet. So I think we're going to have to do some fighting down low, which is fine. We have to be particular about what we fight and where though. So they brought out four bombers in an air dom. Interesting. Uh, but essentially muscle fighting is just going to be done down under the A point, probably under the cap. We will try to climb in the beginning, see if we can maybe get the energy advantage, but yeah, that H-75 and the lag are climbing, so highly unlikely. If we get in trouble, we'll just dive and join the big dog fight. Both teams are staying relatively high. That's interesting. I guess people have learned how to play this stuff over the years. All right, H-75 can hold a lot of energy, so keeping half an eye on him. Gladiator we don't want to head on with, but he wants to head on with us. Let's just make him chase for a minute. He's not low enough on energy that we can stall climb him yet. But he doesn't hold energy very well at all or climb well. I think we do it better than he does. So let's just keep kind of bringing him up. There he goes. He buggered off. That's our time to flip around on him. Make shouldn't have much trouble with him. Nice. All right, nothing much to do up here other than get shot at by a dying gladiator. Let's get the assist on that. Nope, TBD. Stall climbing. We're gonna throw our flaps on. We're gonna go full landing flaps just to flip around quicker. And try to avoid his back gunners, but I also wanna take advantage of a good situation. One more time. Hope that's a friendly. Nope. Alright, see if we can get some shots in the SP2. No, but that mid can. Alright, let's go ahead and reload. We have time. Uh, we're not going to approach the TVD from directly behind. We're going to come off to the side here, wait for the reload, and then attempt to climb stall him right here. So just use your rudder a little bit. Obviously our teammate came in and knocked the shit out of him, which is good. And I think not much for us to do other than go low now. Our engine's yellowed out. Get the guns down. A little bit of a control lock there. Let's go ahead and climb out of that. Conserve as much energy as we can.
So yeah, an air dome is the worst place to be is where most people fight. More exciting, I guess. Alright, P-36. He's doing the flip lead flues. Showing us his cool acrobat moves. We're gonna climb out and uh, while we reload. I have to say this is actually holding energy better than I thought it would. A lot better. Alright, let's do the SP2U. Just kind of the back of the, the train there. Flip around pretty quickly on this one. Two of their planes on our side right now, so let's see if we can be the one on our team to get the kill. We have a decent amount of reinforcements coming in. We're just going to uh, kind of do a reset, reload, get a little energy, wait till our teammates are kind of close to us, which they are. Then we'll go back in as a group. There's two down low. They're climbing again. It's smart. I don't like it when our opponents are smart. Let's go after the I-15. I think we'll have enough support from the guys behind us if we get in trouble. But time will tell. Ended up getting them. On a reload reset. Good enough, try to do a vertical turn, save as much energy as we can. Shouldn't have much trouble with the 109 if we can get behind him. Got more energy than he does. Some good shots. Let's check on the side 15. Good, he's on fire. Out of the guns of these guys, try to slot in behind the D500. Still a lot of shucking and jiving. 109 in front. Just being aware there's people behind us or opponents behind us, so I'm gonna listen for gunshots and Bullets hit your aircraft, and if they do, move. Right, vertical turn. Lined up pretty well. Now roll them. Rudder over. Get back to our side and check our six. Fifteen coming in. Looks like the Jade's going after him, so we'll help him out. Get a little assist here, so we stop shooting at our guy. Got Fifteen here as well. Looks like a dancer. So, two things uh, that are going to counter what I said in the intro. One, it does go decently fast and holds energy better than I thought. I mean, especially considering our engine's been yellow this whole game. Or, not the whole game, but pretty early on. And I've got the other one, but I'm sure it's not important. Alright, we're looking pretty clear to take on this uh, pea shooter. We're not going to dive just yet. He might get shot down and we'd rather go straight down rather than uh, kind of ease our way in anyway. TBD has a tail gunner. We 
got a couple friendlies that it might be concentrating on, so take our chances. CDF turning towards. Gonna put himself in a flat spin there. Our team's definitely doing good. Yeah, they're down to just four. But I've seen cases like this, even though the team you're on is just hammering them. Um, everybody's so low they're not in the cap, and the opponents just come in and take the cap uh, above you. It's just a bad idea with this I-15, but... Oh, we got the F-3 up for support. We're okay. Alright, I'm gonna work on probably the pea shooter first. He's at the back of the train. Well, suffice to say, we did a hell of a lot better in that plane than I thought we would. Ended up with uh, 11 air targets, got survivors, so most kills without dying, and uh, first place on the team. We also unlocked that engine injection, which will make it even easier going forward. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you on the next one. America! Fuck yeah! To say this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.